back into shape. Get back into shape. Get back into shape. Get back into shape. Get back into shape. So I'm going to make this video for accountability. Um, yesterday, I did go for my advanced uh, certification with Patty for scuba diving. Um, I didn't bring any cameras this time, only because it was our first testing. I didn't want to have any extra clutter on me. We we're also on our secondary dive. We're working on uh, peak buoyancy and proficiency, um, looking at streamlining us and looking at how we balance in the water and everything like that. So with the camera, it becomes a little harder. Um, I was going to bring the, the GoPro at the very least. Um, I don't have my charger yet for my sea life, which I think should be in. Jody should have it in uh, now. <laughs> so hopefully I'll have it by next week. But uh, I am doing three more dives on Monday. And most likely I'll have my camera so I can actually do some video and such. Uh, there was plenty of uh, large fish down there uh, during the dives. And I'll give you a brief overview of what the dives actually were. Um, so these dives were in Georgian, um, and I can't tell you where, <laughs> only because it's kind of a, a secret of the dive shop I went with, which was uh, uh, Barry Scuba, Scuba House. So Barry Scuba House. Um, the, for this was the first dive here, and what we were doing was uh, deployable surface marking buoys. Um, we were deploying them, so dove down, went over all the rocks and everything else. Um, and you can see here, tried it three times um, with the, and then we finished the dive at the end here and came on out. So the total dive time was 54 minutes. Um, that's with a regular tank at a depth of 18.8 feet on average, or the max depth anyways. Uh, so nice and shallow. Um, it was a little hard to do the surface markers in this kind of shallow water only because by the time you kind of start out, and you put the air in it and everything, you deploy it, it's like, boom, it's right out of the water. <laughs> so then you're reeling in, and you're reeling in about four or five times, and boom, you're out of the water again. So that makes it a little harder. Um, we did do our second dive here. So this dive was basically swimming out to the 30-foot mark. This is where we did our surface uh, marking buoys. And then we went a little deeper into the about the 50-foot mark, and we worked on our uh, streamlining and uh, buoyancy, sorry, <laughs> buoyancy efficiency. Um, and then we finished off our dive and came back out again. So pretty simplistic dives, nothing special. Water was extremely nice at 68 degrees Fahrenheit. I was just wearing a two to three mil uh, wetsuit, no gloves, no, uh, no hood. So that was a beautiful thing. Visibility was near perfect. So uh, yeah, that's about all I have for this one. I just wanted to highlight that uh, I have been busy and uh, keeping up with the fitness and trying to uh, keep myself outdoors having fun. Thanks for watching, guys.